Next thing I want to do is get my battery. Here it is. And super, super, super crucial, we want to put the four drive battery grease on the front of the battery cell so that it has protection and because I'm going in the salt water and it's just a safety backup. So what I want to do is get the tube and I'm going to put a smear of that right across the terminals of the battery and that is going to give it amazing protection. Take the stubby cooler off, I can see my propellers, motor spins freely, I'm now not going to touch that. I'm going to turn my controller on, little screen comes up and then I'm going to grab this put it in the front of the box and I'm just going to gently slide it all the way in, clunk, it's now connected. Before I put the lid on I just always look down the center line of the box and I make sure my blue o-rings in place, I can see it's there, it's bright blue, fantastic. I've got my nose cone now, I simply slide it over the front, open the latches, push it all the way in close this latch and this latch and then I want to click both latches shut. This nose cone is now in place, it's super solid, it's not going to go anywhere and I want to make sure that everything looks flat on the board, which it is. Okay, so we've just installed everything on the board, but the nose cone's on, battery's plugged in, I've turned my controller on, it should be pre-bound from factory. Stay away from the prop and you just want to test it. It's ready to rock and roll, awesome. Safety note, whenever you're handling this thing and you are not in the water about to run, press and hold the power button and turn it off and check that it doesn't run before you handle this board.